so excited. Today I'm going to be unboxing my BoxyCharm box. I do receive these each month. They are $21 a month and I absolutely love BoxyCharm. It's probably one of my favorite subscription boxes. I'm always so excited to just see it in the mail, you know. I got, like, I love my Ipsy, which I'll be filming that right after this. I was going to combine them, but they're so opposite as far as price and as far as what you get. So I figured it'd be best to just do these in two separate videos for you guys, just in case if you didn't want to listen to Poxy Charm or Ipsy, vice versa, um, you wouldn't have to sit through that. So let's just get into my boxy charm box. It is probably about to storm here. So I'm gonna make this super super fast so I can film both of them. Boxy charm comes in a box like this. Once you open it up there's like a bunch of pink confetti and then they always have like two cards here. Usually one's like a coupon and then the other one gives you the pricing and the theme of the box. So we're just gonna read out the theme. It is the C La V C spelled S E A, Life's Beauty, Charmers, sell away with us as we take time to coast the open waters for adventure. Don't get tied down. Let the sea set you free, just as life should be. That's so cute. Um, XOXO, your boxy charm team. It does list the prices on this side, and I'm not going to look at those until we are done with the box completely. I'm sorry this video is kind of late, but I didn't receive my boxy charm as early as I thought I would, and then I had a lot of other videos to film this past week, so I didn't get a chance. So today is the day that I'm filming this, and it is about to storm. The first thing that I see in here is this NCLA um, nail polish, and I've received an NCLA nail polish and a boxy charm before. It was a heart one, which I think it was like during the February month for hearts. It's like a clear coat, which you really couldn't use, but I love this. This is the NCLA Nudes Collection, and I believe it's in volume five. And it's just like this really pretty muted, it's, it's like almost like a muted pink and taupe combined. I'll see if I can um, switch the screen and show you guys what it looks like close. But it's really, really pretty and I like it a lot. So next thing I see in here is the Click Click Lipstick. And it's by Duce, maybe? I'm not sure. It looks really, really fancy. That's super nice. Oh, so it like, it was in there like this. And I don't know if you can see, but click the bottom and it unclicks. And then you can take it off like that. That is nice. Did melt down a little bit. I'm sure, I mean, it's Louisiana. It's 100 degrees. I'm sure for it to get here from BoxyCharm headquarters, they had to go through freaking a lot of hot weather to get here. So you really can't really, you honestly can't complain about stuff being melted. As long as it's not completely destroyed, I feel like you, you just really can't help it, especially in the summertime and them sending out so many boxes. Um... You know, and I feel like it was packaged well. It could have been a lot worse. So, anyways, this color is something that I probably wouldn't necessarily gravitate towards. To gravitate towards, like if I was to just see it in the store, I don't think that's something that I would just go and and get or whatever. I hope that hair has not been in my face this whole time. How annoying is that? But um, it's like this sheen of like a frost pink. Um, I do have a couple other colors like that that I don't really use that much, but if this formulation is nice and if it looks different on me than the other ones that I have, then I probably will give it a try, but it's super, super nice packaging. I don't even want to know how much this one costs, so can't wait to find out about that one. And then the next thing I see in here is this, I'm going to take the package off, is this Bella Prier Cosmetics brush, and it looks like a little, uh, what do they call this, the blending brushes maybe? And I don't have any one like any brush like this, so that's kind of cool. And it's really, really soft. Um, I'm always looking to get brushes in my boxes because I don't have that many brushes. And I say this every single time I get a brush, but I've collected a lot of brushes through Boxy Charm. Through it. subscription boxes are a good way, like I always tell you guys, to build your makeup collection. If you're new to makeup, if you don't know what brands that you like. It gives you a variety of items that you can choose from or that you could get in a box that you can try out. So you won't just go out and spend the money on something that's just, uh, you know. it's if it, You feel like you're getting this for free almost. Like you feel like you're getting the best of both worlds. You're spending a little bit of money but getting a lot of products. So I really, really like BoxyCharm and Ipsy. Especially BoxyCharm because you do get to try out full-size products. So 
excited to try this out. Next thing in here is my the Beauty Crop, and it is the Lightning Crew, and I'm assuming this is a highlighter. It says it has 80% water-based, no mineral oils, no phosphates, no parabens, no animal byproducts, fragrance-free, which is kind of important, um, because usually if it has fragrance in it, it's going to break me out, and it's nourished with pineapple and green tea. So this sounds very, very interesting. It says it's fragrance-free, but it has a slight hint of pineapple too, which is kind of cool. Um, it is starting to rain, I believe. I don't know if you can tell, but I'm getting, it's getting darker and darker in this room. Oh my god. I don't want to waste any. This is a beautiful highlight. And it's already getting kind of tacky. Beautiful highlight. It has like um, shimmer and maybe like a little bit of gold undertones. I don't know if I can really see. It's like a frost but like a shimmer. I really like that a lot. It looks like a rose gold undertone to it. So I think that's going to show up perfectly on like tan to dark skin. If you're a little bit lighter that may be a little much. But I really like that a lot. Okay, the last thing in here, and it's the biggest thing, and I saved it for last. I'm not exactly sure what this is. It's in a jar like this, so we're just about to find out what it is. It says, a chlorophyll lifting mask by Esclor, or Eselor, maybe. It's green, whatever it is. Whoa. It smells like my grandma. Like, it smells like my grandma's, oh, my grandma's gone to be with the Lord, but... That's what it reminds me of. I bet you my grandma uses like something like this every day and that's why she looked 20 when she was in her 90s. I promise that's what it smells like. That's interesting. I um, have to read a little bit more about this. It doesn't really have any information on it. It is paraben free so it may be good for my sensitive skin. Hopefully it is. If not, not really sure. Okay, let's get into the details about each product. So like I said, it came with a card and lets you know every single month how much the original price for everything is so we're just gonna hop right in and look at the pricing of everything okay guys the first item that we have is the Islar chlorophyll lifting mask this is the full size lifting mask this mask is made up of natural milk proteins plant ash plant extracts seaweed extracts and minerals that tighten the skin help enhance blood circulation and diminish fine lines I am starting to get some lines right here, so I, I'm excited about that. Um, your skin instantly appears luminous and noticeably firmer. How to use twice weekly. Apply thin film on clean face. When dry, rinse with warm water and cleanser. So this full size is $38, which sounds pretty legit for a good facial lifting um, cream, I guess you would call it. Um, that sounds pretty legit because it's Sephora and Ulta or anywhere like that that you're going to get some skincare items. It's going to be up there in price if it does what it says it's supposed to do. So if this is good, which I will let you guys know, I will either have it on my blog or I will tweet or um, I will mention it in a favorite or something like that. I will let you guys know how this product works. So be on the lookout for that. Yeah, excited. And the next one is the brush, the Bella Prier Cosmetics Kabuki Brush. This is a Kabuki brush. Why couldn't I think of that? This is the full size. It's $29.99. That is a little bit expensive and extreme for a brush, especially of this size. But if it does what it says it does, I mean, that's kind of awesome. I don't know if I will repurchase a brush like that. I know that um, there's other brushes out there that I absolutely adore that are not even one-fourth of the price of this one. So that is a little expensive in my opinion, but hey, I didn't pay $29 for it, so I can't complain. The Dulce Click Click <sighs> Lipstick. This is a full size. Fused with soothing and protective ingredients that leave your lips feeling good all day long. So I'm excited to try this. If something's going to leave my lips feeling nice all day long, I'm not really a fan of like Sheen lip products. I don't know I have something that's kind of like a little bit of sheen to it today which by the way I did not plan to wear all this purple and fuchsia and like cranberry. I got it like going on with the purple family right now so just bear with me. If something's gonna leave my lips feeling good all day hey why not give it a try and the full size price for that which is that is the full size is $24. It has not this will not move like it's not even um what do you call it like liquidy anymore like it's on there like it's not going anywhere. This full size of this 
is $16. And I can see that. A highlighter, a good highlighter is going to be kind of up there, which I do love my hard candy one, and it was only 6 bucks. So um, I do need something cream. I have a buxom one. Um, and what else? I think that's the only one that I have that's cream. Oh, I have an e.l.f. one. Um, so I may do like a highlight video and compare the cream ones. And I do have some Becca highlighters that are cream, which I will have a review on that hopefully this coming up week. You guys can check that out. But anyways, back to this one. Um, this is a pretty generous size. I feel like you only need a little bit. I mean, I, I barely squeezed any out and I got that much product. And I think this would be great with like a beauty blender. So, awesome. And the last thing we have is the NCLA Nail Lacquer. And this is the full size, of course. The only thing that we did not get a full size was the highlighter. And that's it. Like, how awesome is that? This is the full size. The value of this is $16. Um, yeah, and this is a very, very beautiful nude. It says that you need one to two coats. I don't mind that. I do not mind that at all. But yeah, I think that's really, really nice, really cool. And yeah, I'm excited. So, guys, that's going to be it for this month's Boxy Charm. Let me know if you guys enjoy me doing these unboxings for you. I really have fun doing them because um, it's like Christmas and it's like I'm opening presents in front of you guys. I don't know. I just really like it. And I think it's a, a good way for me to just sit in front of the camera and be able to let you guys know what's worth the money for the subscription boxes. I know there's a lot of subscription services out there now. It's coming more and more popular, but I'm a die-hard BoxyCharm fan, and I absolutely love them. Um, I will have my link down below. You can It's actually a referral code, so you can click on the link. It'll take you directly to BoxyCharm, and you can sign up. It is $21 a month. They're always doing deals, and things like this, if you want to buy on their site, they always have like discounted and I think it's just really, really awesome. It's a really great deal. And if you still want to get this month's box, um, if it's still available, if they haven't sold out of it yet, you can actually still get this month's box when you order in this month. So I thought that was really cool. So I hope you guys like this video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and let me know if you like it. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you aren't already. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!